that has been where I've been spending a lot of my time. Okay, so the big thing about here is we're definitely getting a workout when it comes to walking stairs. Everywhere is steep. Everywhere is a million stairs to climb. So I'm gonna run you along the ground and you can see what I mean. We start from the bottom. Most of this trip has been yoga every day, that's right. Survivor Man does yoga. Yoga every day, plus a good hard run up some extremely steep jungle hills, and usually followed by a spa. So tons of therapeutic massage every single day. Get a little decadent, and now we're gonna go up a few steps here and go past the uh, Thai kickboxing. Okay, so normally this place seems to be packed, but there's nobody here at the moment. This is the Thai kickboxing camp, and there's lots of them around here. Guys are always getting tattoos, working on the kickboxing, there's big fights here. And of course, here I am halfway around the world, and sure enough, a couple Canadians here recognized who I was. So it seems I can go all the way around the world and still have somebody go, hey, aren't you Les Stroud? <sighs> Which is still cool. Nice guys. And uh, I think what I'd like to do is come back here and spend a month just working out here at the Thai kickboxing camp. Now that would be a workout. So I've been walking you uh, from a uh, place where we're staying at the sanctuary to this next beach here. And this part we're gonna walk on right here is known as the residential district. Check it out. Uh, this is actually the first cloudy day since we've been here. You can uh, walk these beaches and burn the soles of your feet right off, but today it's overcast so it's Beautiful, absolutely beautiful walking on the beach, really. Just not getting as good a tan as I need. They got this whole area, all kinds of flags. Apparently there's a Canadian woman who's been here for four or five years. She's got a bar, restaurant. People actually live here or they rent the bungalows. I don't know, the way I see it, it's still a little sort of a slice of lost hippiedom. If you ask me, there's a lot of hippies here, which is cool. I mean, in a, in a very cool sense, just like everybody's very chilled out. Very laid back, you've all got all, you know, tattoos and the jewelry and the necklaces and the funky clothes and dressed like they should be in Thailand on a beach somewhere. Well, that's my little walking tour of uh, this island uh, off the coast of Thailand. Didn't really want to be a tour guide for you, but I thought I'd take you on a trip to see where I've been. So this is basically, I needed uh, bad to, uh, to chill out. I'm still writing a magazine article about it anyway, but I needed bad to chill out and get myself ready for the next uh, series of adventures and expeditions that I'm going to be doing and filming. And this was a great place to come and do it, basically. Every day was yoga, every day was running on the hills, every day was uh, spa, and if I had another month, I'd, uh, I'd join the Thai kickboxing club here and do that. What a great place to work out, so. Beautiful here. Hey everyone, if you want to see more of my video blogs, go to lesstroud.ca slash videoblog.